Hey guys, it's Sila. Um, and for my next vlog, it's all about today, April 12th, because I'm going to see Mitchell Musso in concert down in Kissimmee. And I'm totally stoked because he's been to Florida probably three or four times within the eight, seven, eight months that I've lived down here. And I've only been able to see him once, but I haven't been able to meet him. I met his mom. She's the sweetest lady ever. I swear. She's like the, one of the best moms I've ever met. But I'm really focused on meeting Mitchell because Mitchell is so awesome. And, you know, if it doesn't work out today, we're going to see how it goes. If it doesn't work out today, then I'm going to see him on the 26th at the Raven concert. Maybe I'll, he'll have a meet and greet and I'll be able to see him there. So, hey guys, so right now I'm in the car. There's some other la library for some tech stuff for my mom. But I'm on my way to Kissimmee. So hopefully this will be a really cool thing. And it's like 12 o'clock. The thing started at 10, but my mom just got off of work. So hopefully he's not gone. He's supposed to be there till, till 3. And he says he has two concerts. So I'm guessing he's performing twice that day, today. So, I don't know. Hey guys, so it's 1 o'clock. Actually, 108 right now. I still haven't made it to the park. And I'm really mad. We've kind of gotten lost. I have no idea what is around Kissimmee. But from another part of Florida, or Orlando. So it's kind of rough. And my mom's getting directions right now. It's at 11. <sighs> so stressful. Hey guys, so it's about time I finished this vlog out. It's um, Sunday, concert was yesterday, the concert was awesome. We finally did get there. The place that my mom actually stopped at was, um, the park was like right around the corner. So thank God she stopped because we would have, she would have just kept driving and we've been totally lost. But yeah, the concert was great. I did get to meet Mitchell. I didn't get a picture. I was sad about that, but I did get to meet him. I got a picture with Mark, which is awesome. And I talked to his mom again and she's still one of the sweetest ladies I've ever met, like in my top two yeah but um oh my gosh it was crazy out there I don't know if you can tell but my nose is like extremely burnt I don't know how many people think that black people can't get sunburned but we can it's like the second sunburn I've ever gotten it's not as bad as the first one but I should not have gone out there without a hat or a sunscreen or something like that because my nose is so burnt and you can tell that I have a tan I don't know if you can see it but if I lift up my glasses like around the bridge of my nose there's absolutely no no sun got there and then on the side of my face it's just and then on my shoulders and stuff like that it's just crazy oh my gosh but yes the concert was great um i don't know what to say it was, it was crazy out there seriously because bec i guess he had to catch a flight or maybe that's just the ploy that they use if they have they want if they just want to get out of there but um they said that they were only giving they were giving out wristbands so he'd only be able to autograph and meet so many people and so people were going crazy just trying to get a wristband because they said they were looking for mitchell fans so basically if you bought like mitchell merchandise there or you had something on that was mitchell then you got one and um i went i saw mitchell in concert in december at the jingle jam tour and i had bought a shirt there and i bought a hat and some other things and so i was like well since i already have that stuff maybe i don't really need to buy anything else i did buy i wanted to buy a picture so he could autograph it if i got his autograph but i was like hmm i don't know if i want to buy anything but i bought a shirt because i was like hey what the heck i'll just buy one of his shirts um because he has like two shirts a black one which i have and now the white one which i have thank god i bought that because basically when they say Mitchell fans about they wanted to see Mitchell merchandise if you had bought it so basically they were looking if you had like a Mitchell shirt on or a Mitchell hat or something like that then they were giving out wristbands and 
I had my shirt on, but the thing was like right before they announced they were doing the bracelets, there were these parents, like two parents, two moms came up to me and said, well, can my child stand in front of you? Because they weren't here for the first concert and they can't see. And since you're taller, can you, can they stand in front of you? And you know, being the nice person I am, I'm like, okay, sure. And so they stood in front, like two, this little boy and this little girl, they were standing in front of me and then they announced about the bracelets. I'm like, I just let these two kids stand in front of me and now they can't see my t-shirt. How the heck, how the F am I going to get a bracelet? Yeah, that was the selfish side of me coming out because hey, I wanted his autograph. It's about time. I don't see how people that have met him like 50 times can do it. It was like so stressful, but I did get a bracelet. Thank God I have it on. It's the one with the R-ding. I have a, cause now, so now I have a Joey Page bracelet and I have one for Mitchell Musso. Yes. But, um, I did get to meet him. I didn't get a picture, um, which was sad, but he looked exhausted. Seriously. Like just the couple of pictures of him that I did get like up close while I was in line waiting to get it. The kid looked exhausted. Oh my goodness. I, I kind of feel bad for him. <laughs> okay. I do feel bad for him. Like kind of, but Hey, he still looked like he had a lot of fun. Um, and I'm going to post, um, videos from the concert. I, uh, I still have videos from December that I haven't posted and that's weird. I don't know why I haven't posted them yet. I'm, I might. I'm debating. But I'm going to post like all the videos I have from yesterday. And there's a video where he did the rock climbing wall because what it was, it wasn't a Mitchell Musso concert. It was like this um, school thing. The school district in that area in Kissimmee they had a um, education in the park thing and he was there doing a concert but it wasn't about Mitchell Musa it was about supposed to be about the schools but I went for the Mitchell because come on anyway so um but they had like different stuff there and they had a rock climbing wall and right after the concert Mitchell went in his little tent or whatever they came out and he went over to the rock climbing wall and it was complete pandemonium just people shoving and pushing and tripping and falling and passing out just trying to get near him and I got a video of it and I think because of that video I got um sunburn on my eyes I don't know if anybody's ever heard of that but because like he, well I, I was filming him like climbing up the wall and like the sun was like right there and so I was like trying not to look at the sun but I pretty much had no choice since he was all the way up there and I was filming it and when you when you see the video you'll understand like I'm surprised I'm thankful that my camera didn't break because I know you're not supposed to like film like the sun directly or look at the sun directly and that was probably a bad choice on my part but yes all in all the concert was great and yeah I just so I just wanted to finish out this vlog and so yeah thanks for watching